Today we are cleaning fuel injectors. Uh, these happen to be 703s. Came off of a Plymouth Breeze. They're the ones that I'm swapping into my XJ Cherokee. But we gotta clean them first because they came straight from the junkyard, as you can see. First thing you need to do is build yourself a little voltage pulser like this guy. So you cut off one of the one of the stock fuel injector connectors like that. And then all you do is wire one of your alligator leads. Alligator lead is going right to the negative side. And then another alligator lead to a switch. Momentary push button, which is pulsing 12 volts to the to your fuel injector. Right there like that. Next you need to have a syringe. I was told a 5cc syringe is what I was looking for, but really what I found that worked is a 6 milliliter. I'm not sure if that's the same size, but it worked. That slips around the rubber o-ring right here. But it's extremely tight and you can't get it on unless you do a little modifying to the o-ring. So what we do is you take a straight edge razor blade and you cut very, very small amounts off of the side of the razor with the razor. Just like something like that. I didn't actually do it because I've already done it to this one, but very small amounts. Then I lube the o-ring up with a little bit of used motor oil because once you're trying to put the syringe on, you don't want to tear the o-ring. But it has to fit on very, very tight. Then, what we can do is this. Give me one second to put this on the tripod. Okay, I'm going to get everything set up now. Voltage source is uh, my motorcycle battery, which is out for the season because it's winter. Connect it up. Now when you connect the uh, fuel injector, you'll hear it click when you're pulsing it. Listen. Okay. Here's the fuel injector that I've already set up. And what we're going to do to mimic the fuel pressure of the fuel rail we are going to use a can of carb cleaner. So we're going to connect it to the end of the can. Damn it. Just like that. We're going to take our electrical connection and we're going to connect it to the fuel injector like this. And what I've already done is I've already cleaned it uh, one way. This is going to be reverse cleaning. Meaning you're putting pressure on the outlet and it's blowing fuel, well, car, car cleaner in this case, out of the inlet. So this is just reverse cleaning it. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to pressurize the tube like this. You'll see it fill up. See it fill? Now when I press the button, it'll pulse it through. Pressurize a little more and pulse it out. Okay, now I'll go ahead and do the other side, which I've already done, but I might as well do it just to show you. Take everything off, disconnect everything, ink your... <clears throat> See, that's on there pretty tight. Put the O-ring on the right side and now this is the difficult part is to get the o-ring or to get the the fuel injector I'm sorry the syringe over the o-ring without damaging it it is a very tight fit it has to be because if it blows off it'll scare you because I might have already done that <laughs> okay so this is the way you might be starting but I had already done it but what the hell, I'll show you anyway. Damn it. 
All right. So now that that's over, we're doing the exact same thing. I'm gonna hold the uh, button right here. You can hear it clicking. And what I'm gonna do is I'm going to maybe I can zoom in for you a little bit. Let's try that. This is kind of a new camera, so this is still kind of new for me. Okay, and what I'm going to do, try to get a better shot for you, is I'm going to pulse it using the switch after I've pressurized it with the can. Watch. There's pressure in now. And that's all there is to it. Clean it out, throw your uh, new Felpro o rings on there like this. These are the packs of four. These are ES570599. These are the packs of four. That's what they look like. They come for the Civics or Breezes. They're the ones, uh, they're the correct size for this fuel injector. And if four comes in a pack, we need 12. So you get three of them. Hope this helps.